all right welcome back to another video on how to become financially secure by looking at the beginner guide to financial statement and understand why we're looking at this and what after all is a financial statement they show you the money and the several type of financial statement such as balance sheets income statements cash flow statements and statement from the shareholders or statement of the shareholders and look at each one of them at least the first three the balance sheet the income statement and cash flow and understand each one of them what are their use case in looking at the cash flow statement which is a report that shows the company inflow and outflow of cash and this is very important because company need to have cash on hand to pay the suspense or purchase assets or and purchase assets so while the income statement can tell you whether a company made a profit a cash flow statement can tell you whether a company generate cash over a period of time and it reuse the information from the balance sheet and the income statement and the bottom line of this statement shows the net increase or decrease in cash over a period of time and this is basically made of three main parts and each part review cash flow from one of these type of activity operating financing and investing so operating after all what they do is to analyze the income or analyze the net income from income investment from income statement and conciliate with the total cash that a company was used uh, for or received from operating activities and that includes adjust the uh, net income for any non-cash item items that affect the state of or items that affect the income statement such as stock-based compensations amortization and depreciation and it also adjusts any cash that was used or perceived from other operating assets and here i ask myself well what are the most common operating assets and liabilities okay so there is a list that ChatGPT gave us here of that and in there I look at the account receivable, inventory, prepay, expand, do what it is here. So when I look at the operating assets there you got it right so accounts receivable inventory prepay expense which are expenses that you do in advance for certain things that you're going to enjoy in the near future or you haven't consumed yet such as premium insurance like health <clears throat> like health for medical coverage home or vehicle so to cover in the case of potential damage accident uh, or thief of your belonging life to coverage in the event of the uh, policy holders death liabilities such as uh, lawsuits disability in the event of suffering uh, an accident that prevent you from working 
in long-term care, like nursing home care or home health care. Another pre-expense pre um, or, or prepay expense is the rent, marketing, office supplies, software licensing, and maintaining contracts. Another operating asset is planned property and equipment, very common in accounting, uh, and intangible assets, where now here you have is patent, exclusive right to the inventors to uh, use, manage, and sell their creations over a period of time. Copyright is somewhat similar, but this is for creator of original works to use and distribute that over a period of time. Trademarks are words, symbols, uh, audio that identify this company from the competition. We also have trade secrets, where this is uh, confidential data that allow companies to gain competitive advantage. Customer relationships and goodwill. The brand reputations and uh, recognitions. Um, yeah, the brand reputations. Uh, oh, yeah, the brand reputations, uh, uh, recognitions, and customer loyalty. And then another operating asset is investment in affiliate. And I slow down here because this is something quite new to me as the intangible assets. Okay. So you have here intangible assets and investment in affiliates. So this is uh, companies that invest in other companies to gain some influence but not full control. And the whole point, they, they made that to a return or from the investment or to gain a strategic advantage. So there's a couple of examples here, like the joint ventures, where now two or more companies join together in a partnership to undertake a specific business activity or project and each company earn a share of the joint vendors for example Crocs and Post Malone okay so they sell all of this flip flop uh, with the Post Malone imprint there you got it Okay. Another example of investment in affiliate is equity investment. So when a company purchases significant amount of stake in another company's stocks, gaining substantial uh, participation and ownership of the company, and, a pot and potentially a voice in the management decisions. And this is something that any time you are in this equity investment or this acquisition, uh, you have to consider, especially if you are an employee, right? Uh, because most of the time after that, they come with some sort of restructuring. So mm, pay attention. Pay attention to this restructuring. Another example is limited partnership, where now a company may invest in a limited partnership to gain uh, ownership in some of the uh, to gain ownership in some of the. Uh, 
is this so a limited partnership a company may invest in a limited partnership that provides share of ownership and control over the partnership partnership assets and operations so essentially this limited partnership okay they give away control in partnership assets and operations to this venture capitalist or a company that invests in that mm, interesting again the whole purpose of this is to not gain full total control but to gain significant influence this is a limited partnership so a company may invest in a limited partnership that provides a share of ownership and control over limited partner or, 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 or control over the partnership assets and operations <laughs> okay so you this the partner in that limited partnership can provide can give away the share of ownership to these new investors and control over the partnership uh, and control so they can give away share of ownership and control of some of your assets and operations mm -hmm. then you get associates right Then you got associates. An associate, an associate is a company in which the investor has significant influence but not control. Typically, to ownership of between twenty and thirty and fifty percent of the voting shares. So when I look at example of the joint ventures, okay, uh, you have is the Crocs and Post Malone, for example. Example of equity investment uh, I think I should ask mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let me add example of equity investment companies Uh, you got it is this so example of equity investments is the Berkshire Berkshire Hathaway mm -hmm. equity investment Berkshire Hathaway It's an American multinational conglomerate holding company headquartered in Omaha, Nebraska, United States. It is made in Omaha, Nebraska, United States. It is main business and source of capital is insurance, from which it invests the float in a broad portfolio of subsidiaries. <laughs> Interest, my friend. Interesting. Interesting. Formerly called Valley Valley Falls Company, and then Berkshire Fine Spinning Associate. Mm. A public company. BRK Berkshire Hathaway. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Mm. 
founded as a textile manufacturing company in 1839 and as a holding company in 1970 53 years ago Oliver Chase New England Textile Manufacturing Company and headquarter in Omaha, Nebraska. Area serve Warren Buffett, Chairman and CEO, and Charlie Munger. What? <laughs> Holy crap. Revenue. Okay. 32.1 billion. Operating income. Minus 30 billion in 2022 net income. Minus 2020.8 billion total assets and total equity. Warren Buffett, 30.71% of the aggregate voting power and 16.45% of the economic interest. Number of employees. The son. Leave us subsidiaries. Holy crap. All of this. Ship. American Express mm. 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 Interesting so you got all of this company. Even Visa. Holy crap. Now this is part of his US listed policy company and ETF holding. List of assets owned uh, list of assets owned by Bersha Haraway. Ownership. Mm. Operating subsidiaries. And then you got the US listed public company and ETF holding. Activision Blazer. Ali Financial. Amazon, American Express. This is part of the limited partnership, actually, or affiliated. Bank of America, Davita, HP, Hewlett. Hewlett Packer, Graf Haynes, Moody's Corporation, Occidental Petroleum, Paramount Global, Haynes, huh? Very sign. And Visa. Hmm. 
Interesting. Very, very interesting. Very, very interesting. So in any case, so Berkshire, Berkshire Hathaway, lead by Warren Buffett and Charles Munger, lead by Charles, um, lead by Warren Buffett and Charlie Munger, a grocery store owned by Warren Buffett grandfather. Ha <laughs> ha! Holy crap! You got 99 years? What? Leading investment at Berkshire Hathaway with Warren Buffett. Mm. As chairman of Wesco Financial Corporation from 1984 through 2011. He's also chairman of the Daily Journal Corporation. Daily Journal Corporation. Okay. <laughs> to me, this is a new brand world. To me, this is a new brand world. Battles and war. He fought in the World War Two. You gotta be fucking kidding me, man! Is that uh, okay? Uh, okay. Principle of inversion. Venerable disease. <laughs> the Bitcoin. No, because it attempts to his assets. So you take a little risk with huge amount of money. This is how you preserve your wealth.
interesting. So in any case, so that is uh, an example of equity investment. Berkshire Hathaway, lead by Warren Buffett. Berkshire Hathaway is a multinational conglomerate holding company that invests in a variety of business, including insurance, energy, and retail. So after all, this is a, a multinational conglomerate holding company that invests in a variety of business, including this. Insurance, energy, and retail. SoftBank Group is a Japanese conglomerate, the same uh, as Berkshire Hathaway, but this is a US multinational conglomerate. Whereas SoftBank is a Japanese conglomerate that makes large equity investment in technology companies around the world. So SoftBank Group's focus is on technology, whereas Berkshire Hathaway invests in a variety of business, including insurance, energy, and retail. So SoftBank uh, has invest, uh, it has invested in companies like Uber, WeWork, and Alibaba. Alphabet is a parent company of Google and makes equity investment in a variety of technology companies through its venture capital arm, GV. Venture Capital Arm, GV. GV Management Company, LLC, is a venture capital investment arm. The main use case for this limited partnership uh, is used as an investment vehicle. Founded by Bill Maris, that provides seeds venture and growth stage funding to technology companies. Founded as Google Ventures in 2009, the first has operated independently of Google. Alphabet Search and Advertising Behemoth since 2015. And Google Ventures. The future according to Google Ventures. Google Ventures. Interesting. In artificial intelligence, e commerce, cybersecurity, fintech. Google Venture has been a lead investor in several fintech startups, participating in seed rounds to companies like Digit, Gusto, Robinhood, and Upstar. The VC early fintech investment focus on payments and its investment portfolio, such as Robinhood, CircleUp, and Stripe. Recently, GV has made several investments in insurance platforms provider, backing follow on deals to Lemonage, Jonah, John Alfred, and Ethos Technology, Health License Science, Enterprise, and others. Impossible Foods and Ripple Food. Mm, here is Venture Capital Arm. Okay. This is another example of equity investment. So Berkshire Hathaway. SoftBank. So Berkshire Hathaway is a multi is a US multinational conglomerate holding company that invests in a variety of business, including insurance, energy, and retail. Whereas SoftBank is, sim is similar in purpose of uh, Berkshire, uh, Berkshire Hathaway. Uh, because this is, after all, it's like a conglomerate of multinational, it's a, um, a Japanese conglomerate that makes investment in technology around the world such as Uber, WeWork, and Alibaba. And then you get Alphabet, which is the parent company of Google and makes equity investment in a variety of technology company, 
through its venture capital arm. And TPG Capital, TPG Capital is a global private equity firm that invests in a range of industries including healthcare, real estate, and technology. Okay. TGP Capital, previously known as Texas Pacific Group. American Investment Company, Private Equity Fund, and Committed Capital from Pension Fund, Insurance Company, Endowment, Funds of Funds, High Net Worth Individuals, Sovereign Wealth Funds, and from other institutional investors. Headquarters Fort Worth, Texas. Texas Pacific Groups in the late 1990s. Mm. TGP and the credit crisis. Post recession activity in 2010. Mm, but this DGP, Texas Pacific Groups, Texas has become a new or is becoming a new financial center, somewhat similar to Miami. You know, somewhat similar to Miami. Mm, interesting. The Blackstone Group is a leading global investment firm that makes equity investment in company across a range of sectors, including energy, financial service, and real estate. So again, each one of them are examples of equity investment. Berkshire Hathaway. Okay, so Berkshire Hathaway, SoftBank, Alphabet, TGP Capital. The Blackstone, the Blackstone Group. Okay, so the Blackstone Group is a leading global investment firm that makes equity investment in company across a range of sectors, including energy, financial, and real estate. Mm, 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 mm. The Blackstone Group. Bank, bank in West Central. It's an American alternative investment management company. Blackstone convert, converted from a policy trade partnership into a C-type corporation. Blackstone private equity business has been one of the largest investors in leverage buyout in the last three decades. While well, it is real estate actively, uh, well, it is real estate business has actively acquired commercial real estate. Mm -hmm. Very, very interesting, by the way. Very, very interesting. So, okay. So that'll be all with example of equity investment companies example. And with that, take care. Bye bye.